In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to complete all of the trophies for the Black Ops 4 Zombies Map 9. So the very first one we're going to start with is My Home is the Arena. To get this, you must survive to round 20 without opening a single gate. I was able to easily do this by having the Mog 12 as my starting weapon. With these attachments, it was pretty much a one-hit kill with headshots until about round 15. Then for the next 5 rounds, I used the Wall Power Elixir to buy an upgraded Strife off the wall. After you've completed the task, its trophy will pop up a minute or two later. Now all of these trophies will always take a bit to show up for some reason, so just keep that in mind. So the second one is Venerated Warrior. To get this, you'll have to complete the map's main easter egg. If you'd like to use my quick solo guide to do that, you can find a link to it in the description. The third one is Skilled Adversary. To get this, you need to complete 9 of your challenges. You start these by going up to one of the 4 banners on the sides of the arena and knifing its rope. You'll know you've completed your 9th challenge when there are 9 medallions on your banner. The fourth trophy is the Slaughterhouse. To get this, you have to dismember 13 limbs and a a single game while in the pit area. The easiest way to do this is by shooting zombies with body shots only. You'll see that as you do this, the zombies will lose their arms. The fifth trophy is a gong like the wind. To do this, you must defeat all eight challengers summoned by a gong within five minutes. What I did was use the wall power elixir to buy an upgraded strife off the wall, then made my way to each of the gods' altar rooms to summon and kill their champions as fast as possible. If you don't want to use an elixir, it might be possible to complete this if you start your game with the Mog 12 or the Sog but you'd probably have better luck if you completed your first three challenges to get that free upgraded strife. But even then, you'll be cutting it close. The sixth one is Gift of Sirket. To get this, you need to simply retrieve the Death of Orion from the box, whether it be normally or by doing the Easter Egg, then upgrading it to the Sirket's Kiss. If you don't already know how to get the Death of Orion for free, you can find the link to my quick guide in the description. The seventh trophy is Here Kitty Kitty. To get this, you need to kill a regular tiger with a brain rotted tiger. The best way to get this done is by upgrading a a weapon on the weaker side until it has the brain rot effect, then waiting for a special round with nothing but tigers. As you can see, it took me until my last two tigers to get this. The eighth trophy is Acidic Alchemy, and to get this, you must build the Acid Trap and get a kill with it in each of its four craftable locations. To actually build the Acid Trap, you'll first need to collect three parts. The first part can be collected after completing your first three challenges at spawn. You can then find the last two parts in the temple, one at each end of these two side rooms. You're looking for a wooden cog and chain. After that, you can craft it at either the entrance to the Ra or Danu Tower, and then the final two locations can be found on the stairs leading up into the Odin and Zeus altar rooms. And finally, the last trophy is Constellation Prize. To get this, you must kill 9 zombies with a single, uncharged shot from the death of Orion. Keep in mind, this cannot be done with the upgraded Sirket's Kiss. What I did was hoarded up a bunch of zombies in the arena, then fired one normal shot at their heads. I also checked how many kills I had before I shot, and how many I had after, so I could know for sure if I got it. 